we went in and asked for additional dollars this session. We are doing a good job being good stewards of those dollars. One, we, we're continuing to get money to fund our IT project. That's important to this agency. It's important, frankly, to the state. We are now officially in charge of gathering lines in this state. We really need to be actively inspecting, so we need more people. We've got dollars for that, as well as other environmental projects we're continuing to work on. So we had a great session. Our well plugging program, we do a great job. I think we're one of the best at it in the country. And so this year I was really proud of this agency for being recognized from IOGCC. Actually for our second time, this, will, this project we cleaned up the big thicket uh, over in East Texas. I think that there's a lot of national recognition for how well we're doing with well plug plugging and the professionalism you see in our agency. Well plugging's been a priority since I've been at this agency. In fact, I think we've plugged more wells in this state just generally than any other state has across the country. This past year we received $25 million, more or less unrestricted dollars to plug additional wells. We still have our state program going on, but we've got federal dollars now. So we plugged about 730 additional wells this year. With, and you can track those on our website. We hope Long term in the federal program, we'll get a total of $313 million to plug about 8,000 wells and or clean up a bunch of sites for us. The oil and gas industry in Texas needs to remain strong. When you're seeing what's going on in Ukraine, now Israel, we are shipping our products all over the world and people don't want to do business with Russia, for instance. They'd rather get the U.S. natural gas and we're, we're glad to sell it to them, right, with our LNG program. Then the oil and gas industry in Texas is 30% of the state's economy. Texas is, is unto itself and I think we continue to lead not just oil and gas but in a lot of things across the country.